Hi guys, just finished building my Alex IKEA desk. It's very nice. Um, drawers, very very spacious. You can see I've got a big book that's all the way to the back. You see the size of it. Drawers aren't the height wise. I wouldn't say they were massively great in height. You probably get about three books high. Okay, the other side, same. The Alex desk has a hidden compartment at the back, which is ideal for cable management. Um, most of the videos I watched on YouTube before I bought this desk were all American based. So it did show American plug sizes. Uh, so I just wanted to make this video to show people the um, size of the plugs and what space you do have. So, I have a multi socket coming up through the back. You see the plugs there on it. You see it's there. I've got a small hard drive just here. You can see the length of my hand. Yeah, it's got nice two openings on either side. You can see there's a power block for the monitor. And there. Now, I have a Western Digital hard drive on there. Probably a very similar element, uh, elements drives. And one thing I have noticed is the power plug for this is quite large. So it does not fit in. So that's one thing to be made aware of, is that it just will not fit sideways. If you do put it in, you do try to squeeze it and you're pressing into the drawer and then the drawer gets pushed out and will not shut. The other one was Apple's own cable for my MacBook Pro. See there, that's quite a large one. There was absolutely no way that was fitting in at all. So you are very, very limited with plug size and um, I had to swap a cable out my Bose speaker because the Bose speaker uh, plug did not fit it so I've just used an Amazon one and um, so I'm going to need to look at a solution try and find a smaller plug for this to try and get this in so I can use my hard drive so hope that that's okay and you understand the size of the desk but otherwise great sturdy desk very happy with it.